Hello my beautiful friends. Welcome to a new video. Thank you so much for watching. I was really excited to film for you today from a new space. Many of you that follow me on Instagram know that Jeremiah, my husband and I, recently got my mom her own space, her brand new apartment, which she really loves and it looks really cute, so thank God. But now I was left with this spare bedroom that is not really used that often. Oh, I got something in my eye. So I figured I'd make the most of it and turn it into a walk-in closet slash makeup vanity area slash, I don't know, different little recording nooks for you guys so I can change things up and make things more interesting and give you more of a variety in my backdrops. All I have is this vanity area, which, oh, I think it got dirty. <laughs> and this desk, this white desk, which you can, I guess you can see the reflection. Both of them actually from Amazon, so the rest of the room is quite literally empty and I'm really keeping my fingers crossed that there's not going to be any uh, bounce back of the sound so it echoes. Probably end of December, beginning of January, I will be done so I'll be able to give you guys a nice room tour and start filming from there. Anyway, I wanted to use today's video as an opportunity to show you a couple of new items that I've purchased over the last couple of weeks as well as share some exciting news or announcements, sort of speak. So yeah, let's get started. The first products I wanted to show you are from Anastasia Beverly Hills and I purchased two liquid lipsticks and two lip glosses. What's interesting is that not too long ago, one of my girlfriends was asking for my honest feedback about the liquid lipsticks and I was telling her that I was a little bit disappointed. The product was actually gathering um, a little bit at the corners of my mouth and I really disliked that. And I was a little bit disheartened until I decided to pair the liquid lipstick with a lip primer. The only lip primer that I own is from Stila and I talk about it in many of my Instagram posts where I share details of makeup looks. So do I think it's good? Yes. Do I have anything to compare it to? No. But ever since I started applying a primer first and then going in with the liquid lipsticks, I noticed a huge, huge difference. The product doesn't run and start hiding through little crevices. It doesn't gather at the corners of the mouth. So needless to say, I was super excited because this means I get to buy more lipsticks. Ha ha. So let's start with the lipsticks. The first one is called Potion. You can't really tell from the bottom, but I will swatch them for you. And the second one is called Vintage. For the lip glosses, the darker color is called Bordeaux. And the lighter color is fudge. The next product that I purchased is also from Anastasia and I have to be honest, I dipped my little claws in it already and have used it. I was really excited to get, ooh, that might help. I was excited and reluctant in the same time to try this palette, excited because I'm always looking forward to trying new products, especially Anastasia ones, but reluctant because the palette seemed a little bit disjointed. At first it just seemed like there were so many different colors, not exactly sure how to pair them until somebody told me that this palette was designed to be used in quads. <laughs> how did I not think of it? So take the palette itself, right? It looks like there's just a wide variety of different colors until you start pairing them into fours. You take these four, for example, or those, or those, and suddenly when you pair them in fours, the palette starts making sense. Brilliant! I wish this would have been made more obvious on their website because at the time when I purchased this, it was not made evident that, oh, duh, you can use it in four and it makes sense. Oh. As per usual, the colors are extremely rich, extremely vibrant, they spread very easily, they're so easy to work with, and I am madly and utterly in love. I would throw it on the floor, but no. The next products I wanted to share remind me that I have my first announcement to make. I decided to create a brand new playlist on my current channel right here that is all about aging. I don't want to call it anti-aging content because aging is inevitable, but I will be your guinea pig. In a nutshell, I'm going to share with you the most amazing things that I discover, that I try, that I search for, tips, tricks, recipes, ideas, products, a variety of different things that I'm trying and that I see working in an attempt to age as youthful and graceful as 
possible. It doesn't matter what age or nationality you have, the sooner you start taking care of your skin in this way, the better. And there is no better time than right now, or should I say the first week in January, because that's when I plan on launching my first video. So yay! One of the many things that I've been drawing are these three little razors. Basically, I bought them from Amazon. They are eyebrow razors, but I'm using them for more than just my eyebrows. These are part of me being a guinea pig and trying a bunch of different things for you guys and relaying back what has been working and what hasn't. So I will be talking in depth about these in the future if they do work or not. But for right now, I wanted to share with you that I just bought them. The next product, damn, really? What is this glued? Where were we? Oh yes. The next product that I purchased and I haven't had a chance to use yet is from Mario Badescu. Why am I even saying it like that? I think it's Romanian. Okay, for all my international friends out there, it's Mario Badescu, okay? Mario Badescu, it's a facial spray with different herbs and rose water. A week ago when I was getting my nails done, I was overhearing these two girls talking about the product. So I swear, if you are somewhere in public talking beauty or cosmetics, I'm gonna be doing this, huh, what? <laughs> I'll be totally eavesdropping in your conversation because I'm really excited to learn about new products and I love trying new products because then I can relate back to you. So yes, I am nosy, but I love the fact that this has rose water. There's so many benefits to rose water. This is used not only as a rejuvenating facial spray, but if you're using makeup, you can help set it with this while smoothing your skin in dehydrating conditions or give your skin a quick boost anytime, anywhere. I love my Pixi Beauty setting spray, but I also love rose water. So that's why I wanted to give this a try. And since I haven't set my makeup yet, oh, there we go. Wow, it really does, <coughs> just don't inhale it. It really smells, like rose water, I like that. Okay, we'll see how it makes my makeup look in just a minute and then you can decide for yourself, I guess. Keeping on the makeup theme, I got two lip liners from Motifs Cosmetics. I have used them before, but they were almost out, so I wanted to get them again because I like them. The darker one is called Cinnamon and the lighter one is Neutral. I will also swatch these for you. Top one is Cinnamon, the bottom one is Neutral. I really like these products, although I did notice with most Motif's lip liners that they kind of crumble, they fall apart when sharpening them. And literally, I'm like sitting there twisting and all of a sudden the whole pen just kind of falls apart and product is getting wasted. And they're not cheap lip pencils, so that constitutes a problem for me. I don't like wasting money. If you're ever faced with this situation and don't like wasting money either, one thing that I recommend doing is placing your lip liners in the freezer for about three to five minutes and then sharpen them and you will notice a difference. So I got these two. Also from Motifs, I bought a brand new nail polish. It looks kind of blue with gray undertones and it's called Daydream. The last things I wanted to show you are from Daily Vice. It's a company that I've mentioned in past videos. What is this? Oh yeah, Daily Vice. Let me actually put these rings away so I can show you what I bought from them. I'm quite literally obsessed. When we landed from our girls Vegas trip, I was on the tarmac when the pop-up on my iOS, because I have their iOS app, came on and you know, notifying you of their new products. So I literally opened it up, loved it. I actually loved this ring and I purchased it on the spot. One of my girlfriends was saying, you really truly have a problem and she is correct. So the first ring is like this X kind of cross ring. It's really beautiful and I also have it in yellow gold. And talking about yellow gold, I shall forever remember this as the airplane ring. How cute is that? I know I have an addiction, but I justify it to myself that at least they're on discount because all of their products are discounted. So if this ring will normally cost $100, you can get it for like 25 bucks from their site. No, this is not a sponsored video. I'm literally obsessed with these people and they don't even know it. <laughs> I'm like a stalker. The second exciting announcement before I let you go, and yes, this one is exciting. When am I not excited to talk to you guys? I swear. Anyway, the exciting news is that in less than 30 days, I plan on doing a giveaway on my channel. I would like to buy a purse, a backpack, I don't know, a type of bag, and essentially fill it with a bunch of goodies that I have been saving for you guys for the last couple of months. I've been gathering like a little teeny tiny rat in anticipation of doing this for you. And there are a bunch of amazing things in here. Different makeup products, 
nail polishes, these coasters that are really awesome, hand lotions, like, I don't know, just a bunch of different things and a bunch. Even a couple of little brushes. So quite a few products. The only other thing that I thought about was making this giveaway international because I want for everybody, no matter where you are in the world, I want you to be able to participate and have a chance at winning. You guys have been so supportive and so amazing. This is literally, truly the most significant and the most amazing group of people that I have ever had around me in my life. So I wanted to do this as a little thank you, but as a thank you nonetheless for being so loving, so supporting, for watching these videos, for being subscribed, for suggesting topics and things like that so I hope that I'll be able to make somebody hopefully you watching make your holidays a little bit more exciting so definitely stay tuned and that is it for today may good luck and fortune follow you everywhere you go today and every day I love you and I'll see you very soon bye